This is Mr. Martin. Uh, in this video, we're going to look at another uh, example for the triangle sum theorem or conjecture, whichever one you want to call it. And uh, we're going to look at number 12 for this one. And we see that we have an expression for uh, the three angles of a triangle. And we know that the uh, three angles of a triangle have to add up to 180. So these three highlighted expressions are going to have to add up to 180. So let's go ahead and add them up. So I've got 9x plus 3 plus 11x minus 21 plus 5x minus 2 is going to equal 180. All right, so now that we're here, we're going to combine like terms. So I have a bunch of x's, and I have a bunch of constants. So we'll uh, combine those. So 9x plus 11x, that's 20x, plus another 5x, that's 25x. And then 3 minus 21 minus 2, that should be minus 20. So that equals 180. And we'll add 20 to both sides. And I get 25x is equal to 200. Feel free to pause the video uh, if I'm going too fast or if you have questions that you want to ask or write down. So x is 8. All right, so we have x is 8. Now, if you notice, they want us to find the measure of angle D, E, and F. So they want us to find the three angles of the triangle. So let's start with uh, D. So angle D is going to be 5 times 8, because that's what we found for X minus 2. So that's 38. So 38 degrees. And then let's find E. Now, I'm going to find these in order, but we don't always want to find them in order, or we sometimes we can't find them in order, but in this case we can't, so we won't. So angle E, remember this little M stands for measure. So E is 9 times X, which is 8, plus 3, and that's 75. And then angle F is 11 times 8 minus 21, which is 67 degrees. Okay, now we can check to make sure that we did it right by adding those up. So that's a 15, that's 20. And then 10, 12, and 6 is 18, 180 degrees. So those add up to 180. We did it right. Again, if you have questions, make sure you get those answered. And we'll see you next time.